Good afternoon. There's a the potential for some quite impactful thunderstorms through the next couple of days, but for most of us, it will be staying dry, warm and sunny. This is a satellite picture from overnight. You can see the radar showing heavy thunderstorms across northern areas of Europe that did clip the coast of the southeast, bringing lightning here overnight. Elsewhere, though, it's been a fairly dry and bright start. Quite a chilly start across parts of Scotland, but it will remain dry and fine across much of Scotland, Northern Ireland, Northern England and and across much of southern areas of England and Wales too. Plenty of sunshine to come throughout this afternoon. However, across the southeast, that risk of thunderstorms does continue and they could bring some quite torrential downpours. So do keep an eye on the radar on our weather app if you're in these areas. There is a warning in force. But as I said, for most of us, it's going to be a dry and another warm day. Temperatures are likely to climb into the 30s for some areas, but quite widely across England and Wales into the high 20s. The humidity will slowly start to rise through today as well. Further north, for Northern Ireland and Scotland, it's nowhere near as warm, but it will be quite pleasant in the sunshine, I think. Still fresher, though, across the far northwest of Scotland, where there will be a risk of some drizzly rain overnight tonight. We've got weather fronts still close by to the far north and west. But it's overnight that the thunderstorm risk really does pick up. We've got to see a few areas develop across Wales into northeastern areas of England, as well as across the southeast as well. Now, these could bring some very torrential downpours, hail and some frequent lightning as well. Away from the areas of thunderstorms though it's going to be a fairly humid night. Temperatures quite widely in the high teens and even across in parts of Scotland where it was a fresher night last night it will slowly start to be pick up over here as well. So a fairly muggy start to the day. Risk of some torrential downpours continuing through the morning particularly across eastern areas of England where that's where we have a warning in force spreading into parts of Wales as well but it's into the afternoon once this main area moves out the way we could see further thunderstorms start to pop up. And these bring a risk of some localised flooding. We could see up to 100 millimetres of rain falling in a few hours if you see a few thunderstorms falling in the same place. So do keep up to date with the forecast for the next few days if you're in that warning area. Further north, though, it should stay much drier across parts of Wales and Northern Ireland through much of the day. Temperatures again into the low 20s, so quite pleasant in the sunshine. Fairly light winds as well for the bulk of northern areas of the UK. In the south as well, still feeling quite hot and more humid tomorrow. Temperatures widely again into the high 20s. And the humid theme will continue into Friday as well. We've got a continued risk of these heavy downpours pushing eastwards. The warning is still in force through Thursday evening. From the west, though, it does turn much drier. And actually, as we head into Friday and the weekend, it looks like we'll see a change to much fresher conditions. But you can find more details in that on our latest 10-day trend with Alex Burkill on YouTube. See you again soon. Bye-bye.